Over the years, Google Street View has captured some pretty insane pictures of unexplainable things, from kidnappers to gruesome crime scenes to a whole bunch of other horrific scenes. I mean, Google seems to have captured it all. These photos have sparked a lot of controversy and debates online because people are trying to figure out what really went on in these pictures. Some of them are harmless, while others will send chills down your spine. <laughs> How's it going, YouTube? I'm your host for this one, Landon Dowsing. Welcome back to another Most Missing Top 10 video. Have you guys checked our brand new channel? Bam! Right over here. This is our most recent video. Make sure you guys go check it out. We're super proud of it. We're so pumped for it. It's Top 10 Central. We post a ton of hilarious videos for you guys, so make sure you go subscribe. For you guys who are having, you know, a bad day, a rough day, it's a channel to entertain you guys. We want to make you guys get through your days. And I'm on the channel. We got Amy on the channel. We have two other big hosts on the channel. I really think that you guys should go check it out. I really think you'll enjoy it. Let's dive into this list. This is the top 10 scary Google Earth images that will keep you up tonight. Starting things off, in at number 10, we have a kidnapping. I wasn't trained by the police academy, but I've seen enough episodes of Criminal Minds to know that this woman is not in an ideal situation. There's a lot of negatives going on for her at the moment. First of all, it looks like she's being held at gunpoint with the tiniest gun in the world. I mean, what the heck is that? And then we have another guy who is next to a sketch car with the trunk open. Judging by the body language, she knows that she's in uh, some pretty deep trouble. Nothing good can ever come from being in an alleyway with strangers with an open trunk. I really hope this picture isn't what it seems, but I think we are literally looking at evidence of a kidnapping. Smoke Monster is next up at number 9. Take a look at this strange, you know, formation of smoke that appeared over a small town in Italy. No one knows what exactly this thing was or how it even got there. But I have a few theories. I think either the smoke monster is the smoke monster from, you know, Lost. Or we can have a new SCP to worry about. Maybe this is one big government conspiracy that they're trying to cover up, but the smoke doesn't normally do that. How can all these tiny molecules go in such a strange pattern? Should we all be concerned with this one? The answer is yes. Yes, we should be. A blood-filled leg takes us to number eight. Back in 2007, this picture appeared all over Google Maps, and it looks like it's a lake filled with blood. I mean, creepy, right? But if you were to search for these exact same coordinates today, you'll see that now it looks like a regular boring lake. So what exactly happened in 2007? Was there a mass murder? Well, sadly, there isn't an official explanation for what caused the water to turn red. But people are speculating that a bunch of slaughterhouses were disposing runoff blood into the lake and yeah, that's what caused the water to turn bright red. It, it was, it might have actually been real blood. This is the kind of stuff that you should never have to read about. So you know what, let's move on. Let's see what other disturbing images we have on this list. Number seven, we have the village of dead dolls. The village of Nagaro in Japan creates life-size dolls that are built as a way to pay respects to someone who has died. They place these creepy dolls all over the town where people might have died. Today, there are hundreds of these scarecrows spread all around the village. And there's just something really creepy about that. These life-size dolls actually outnumber the human residents of the village, you know, 10 to 1. In a way, I think it's a pretty cool art project, and it's a nice way to remember those people who have passed. But another side of me is thinking that this is one of the creepiest things I've ever seen or ever heard of, and I don't actually have a desire to, to visit this village. A UFO lands itself at number 6 on this list. Even though the Area 51 raid was, it was unsuccessful, we still might have proof that aliens exist. I'm mean, gonna take a look at this picture right here. This was captured on Google Earth camera, and it looks like we have a white pickup truck parked next to an alien UFO. Is this real life right now? This picture looks like it was taken in a remote area in the desert, and maybe the people in the truck were sent over to this crash landing site to do some investigating. No one from Google cared to comment on the picture, and everyone is just playing the dumb card. What are they really hiding? Did a UFO escape from Area 51? Well, we may never know the answer to that. A dead body brings us to number five. When I first look at this picture right here, I was actually pretty concerned. It looks like this woman is dead, just laying on the sidewalk, baking in the sun, 
And then I got to wondering that someone was literally driving in a Google Maps car and they didn't even stop to see if this girl was alive. They just, oh, she might be dead, but I have a job to do. I'm gonna ignore that. I'm gonna continue down the road. Well, they just kept on driving and taking their pictures because I guess they didn't want to lose their jobs at Google. But thankfully, as it turns out, the internet solved the case of this mysterious dead woman. Apparently, this girl was just trying to prank her friends by pretending to be dead. And I don't know about you guys, but is this just me? Or does that girl just seem to be uh, a little bit too extra? I mean, how long did she have to lay like that for uh, to pretend that she was dead? And dead pranks, they're, they're just not funny pranks. I think she should brush up on her prank ideas because at this rate, she won't have any more friends if all of her pranks are this terrible. A crime scene brings us to number four. All right, brace yourselves for this one because what I'm about to show you might actually be a picture from a real life crime scene. Doesn't it look like someone dragged a dead body on the dock and left it there? My question is, why would someone go through all that trouble to just leave the body on the dock. I mean, the lake is literally right there. Okay, am I really suggesting this right now? But I think they should have taken the body, dumped it in the water, and put an anchor on it. I don't know, I've, I watch movies. <laughs> well, before you guys get too scared with this one, this isn't actually what it looks like. I wouldn't show you guys a, a crime scene like that. I mean, that's crazy. This is just a picture of a few people walking on the pier with a dark brown dog. And those blood stains are just from the red stained wood that probably got wet because the dog went for a swim. I guess the mystery is solved, but you know what? Maybe this is what Google wants us to believe. Maybe they're the ones that came out with the statement. You know, we've solved the crime. It's not a murder scene. A severed leg takes us to number three. I want you guys to take a real hard look at this guy's leg. I mean, what the heck are we even looking at here? It seems like he went hiking, severed his leg, and then sat down for a nice scenic picture. So what really happened here? Well, in 2017, someone was trying to get a satellite image of the Black Sea, and they came across this guy who's missing half his leg. Obviously, his leg isn't actually severed, and it's just a tactical issue. Pretty bad timing with this one, but it still looks pretty scary when you look at it at first. If you guys are still curious, the image is still up on Google Maps. You guys can go search it. I, I'm just not sure what you would type in. Don't type in severed legs because, oh my God. <laughs> Hopefully the, the safe filter is on because that can get pretty bad. The bent legged lady makes an appearance on this list at number two. I think it's safe to say that we've all stumbled across this picture, you know, sometime in our lives, right? And honestly, it never gets old. I'm starting to believe that this woman isn't human. No one's legs should be able to do that. All over the internet, she's being called flamingo legs and she's been freaking people out. Apparently Google needs to reinvest in some of their cameras because this picture is nothing more than a glitch with the camera lens. I mean, don't worry, her legs aren't actually like this, I, I don't think. <laughs> but you would think that a multi-billion dollar company would have cameras that don't have glitches at all. But I guess they're trying to still save money where they can because they want to stay rich. A sunken car tops this list off in at number one. I know what you guys must be thinking. What's so scary about a sunken car, you know? Woo. Well, in reality, nothing at all except for when that sunken car has a dead body inside of it that's been missing for nine years. Yeah, that went from zero to 10 real fast. Well, let me explain. Employees from a Michigan funeral home were decorating a tree for the holidays when they spotted the roof of a car floating in a nearby pond. When the police came to investigate, they discovered the body of a man who was reportedly, you know, missing nearly two decades ago. He didn't make it home one night after he was out at a club with some friends. Well, Maps. Yes, it was on the shoreline. A 1994 Saturn SL last registered to William Earl Moult, who disappeared in November 1997. One report from an online database of cold cases in the US said that this car had been visible in Google Earth satellite photo since 2007, but apparently no one noticed it until 2019. This is legitimately so terrifying. I think I need to stay away from Google Earth images for a while, especially doing the research for this one. I've, I've seen so much. <laughs> well, there you guys have it. You made it to the end of this video. I was your host, Landon Delting, and uh, I'll see you guys all in the next most amazing top 10 video.